enters at a relative angle of beta 1 to this rotor blade. Now what is beta 1? The tangent at the inlet of the blade surface which it makes with the axial direction of the flow. So this angle between this green chalk and the blue chalk is beta 1. Now beta 1 is the angle between the relative velocity with respect to the rotor plates and the central axis which is the axial direction of the flow. Now this blade is having a camber or a curvature. So what this blade does? It changes this angle, it turns the blade, it turns the flow through certain direction. Now this was beta 1, you can see, and at the trailing edge, this is beta 2. So you can see this beta 2 is different from beta 1. Beta 2 has reduced. Mm. Here beta 1 was more. Can we say? The rotor blades have turned the relative flow towards the axial direction. And in turbine, the opposite happens. The relative flow in turbine is changed away from the axial direction. Here, the flow is entering in this direction, the green chalk. Now this flow was entering like this, mm -hmm. but it is leaning at a smaller angle. It mm -hmm. means the compressive blade has turned the flow in towards axial, axial direction. So this was one important point which I wanted to share with you. My dear friends, the rotor blades also have diverging passages. The flow area at the trailing edge. These, these are the trailing edges of these blades and these are the leading, leading edges. edges. The flow area between the trailing edges is more than the flow area between the leading edge. Leading edge. It means we have diverging passages. So, pressure also increases Increase. inside the rotor blade. The rotor blades impart kinetic energy to the flow. So, rotor blades increase the absolute velocity of the air. The kinetic energy of the flow is represented by absolute velocity and not relative velocity. Now, rotor blades have increased the kinetic energy of the flow. The stator veins which come in between the two rows of rotor blades, they change this kinetic energy into pressure. Because stator veins have got diverging passages. And in stator veins, the velocity reduces. It means pressure. the velocity head has been changed into pressure head. As pressure increases, the temperature also increases in the compressor. Now, this is an axial flow compressor. Why we call it axial? Because the air is going like this. This is called axial direction. There, is, there are two more directions. This one. This is called radial direction. From the hub outwards along the radius of the circle. This is called radial direction. In centrifugal compressor, the flow is in the direction of radial line. That's why in centrifugal force is act. Fine. There is a third direction, which is called tangential direction or wall direction. This blade is rotating. The tip of the blade is coming down. This is tangent to the circle here. This is called tangential direction. As I already told you, the rotor blade imparts a whirl component to the velocity. It imparts momentum in the tangential direction. Sum it up. Compressor rotor blade turns the flow towards the axial direction. The compressor blade rotates towards concave side. Kinetic energy is increased in the rotor blade and this kinetic energy is changed into high pressure in the state of blade. Last point comes to my mind. Axial flow compressor, we have a number of stages. One rotor blade, 
रो एंड वन स्टेटर वेन रो कॉन्स्टिट्यूट वन स्टेज ऑफ रिकम्प्रेसर दिस रो प्लस द स्टेटर वेन विच आर नॉट हेयर दे आर फिटेड टू द केसिंग विच विल बी फिटेड ओवर दिस इंजिन दे कॉन्स्टिट्यूट वन स्टेज नाउ इन दिस इंजिन वी हैव गॉट टेन स्टेजेस इट मीन्स टेन रोज ऑफ रोटर प्लेट्स फॉलोड बाय टेन रोज ऑफ स्टेटर प्लेट्स इन अ सेंट इन एक्सीएल कंप्रेसर स्टेज प्रेशर आइज इज स्मॉल इट इज अराउंड वन पॉइंट टू वन पॉइंट थ्री और वन पॉइंट फोर बट इन सेंट्री फ्यूबल कंप्रेसर इन वन स्टेज यू कैन इंक्रीज द प्रेशर फ्रॉम फोर टू एट बट इन सेंट्री फ्यूबल कंप्रेसर डायरेक्शन ऑफ द फ्लो हैज टू बी चेंज टू नाइनटी डिग्री बट हेयर द फ्लो इज ऑलवेज स्ट्रेट सो द डायरेक्शन ऑफ फ्लो डजेंट चेंज मच सो एक्सिल फ्लो कंप्रेसर इज सुटेबल फॉर मल्टी स्टेज सो पर स्टेज प्रेशर आइज इन एक्सिल फ्लो कंप्रेसर इज लेस बट बाई हैविंग मोर नंबर ऑफ स्टेज इन एक्सिल फ्लो कंप्रेसर द टोटल प्रेशर आइज कैन बी मच मोर इन द एक्सिल कंप्रेसर एज कंपेयर टू सेंट्रल प्रेशर माई डियर फ्रेंड्स नाउ वी विल फाइंड आउट हाउ मच पावर अ कंप्रेसर एब्जॉर्ब दिस वी कैन फाइंड आउट विद द हेल्प ऑफ वेलॉस्टी डायग्राम्स सो I request you to come to the board please